If you watched our other video, we stayed at the Lakeside Inn here in Mount Dora. And during that video, we said we would do some reviews of some of the restaurants they have on property. So tonight, we are going to try their Tremaine's Tavern. The menu's not online, so we're not sure what they offer, but it is like a barish setting in the main lobby. So we're just gonna go give it a try. Let's go check it out. In that video of Lakeside Inn, we did a tour of the whole property. And this video is just gonna be about the little tavern, but we'll show you where it's located. So you're gonna go up, normally you'd go up the main stairs, but since they're working on the stain, you're gonna come to this side and go up these. And you're gonna go in the main doors and it should be right on the left-hand side. All right, we'll have to show you here on the left-hand side, I believe. Yeah, tree mains. Please see the bartender to be seated. So, so Tremaine's Tavern opens at 11, but it shows breakfast Monday through Friday, 8 to 10, 15, Saturday and Sunday, 7, 30 to 10, 15, lunch, 11 to 2, 30, bar menu, 3, 30 to 5. That's Friday through Tuesday. Dinner, Sunday through Thursday, 5 to 8, 30, Friday and Saturday, 5 to 9, live piano Wednesday and Thursday, 6 p.m. to 9 p.m., Friday and Saturday, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. It's right here, and it also shows restrooms through lounge. So I guess it said, see bartender for seating. So maybe we can just go in here and sit down at one of these areas. There's the piano right there. So we just said we can sit wherever we'd like. So here's a little, you wanna go in that one then? Here's a little two seater table. I love how they made this look in here. This is fun. Yeah, so restrooms are right through that little door. There's a little fireplace pictures on the wall and this is what it looks like in here pretty neat so we just learned something that Tremaine's is just for drinks but the Beauclair is if you want food so I guess technically this is going to be the Beauclair review is that right we thought Tremaine's tavern had food like bar food but it looks like if you want the actual food, it's the Beauclair. So maybe we'll label the title, both of them, I'm not sure, but here's the menu of the Beauclair. So we've got the white and red wines up top, sparkling in champagne. Ask about our $8 Crane Lake house wine selections. Here are our house cocktails. There are no prices on the cocktails. Here are beers and beers. Over here we have starters. He said the soup of the day was chicken cordon bleu, right? I think that's what he said, chicken cordon bleu. So those are the starters. Then if we move down here are the entrees. So make note that a shared plate is 10 extra dollars and they do have indicates gluten-free. So they do have some gluten-free options. I'm not sure what I'm going to get yet. So I'm gonna just look over the menu. I might have to try a drink because this is just like a little special place that we won't go to probably very often. Um, I'm not sure which one, but I'm gonna look over the menu here real quick. We just got waters for now. A few things, the chicken pot pie is a lakeside in tradition. And then over here, the Southern Comfort Burger has pimento cheese, locally grown lettuce, sweet potato fries, but then the pasta sounds good too. What are you doing? Chicken pot pie. You're gonna do the tradition. Mm -hmm. Traditional chicken pot pie. That sounds good. I might go pasta lakeside. Mm -hmm. That sounds good. I mean, so does the burger though. Which would you choose? Pasta or burger? I might ask him. I might say pasta or burger and let him choose. That's true. I didn't see the sides. Hash brown, casserole, and sauteed Brussels sprouts and bacon. Maybe do I just... Mm, but it is $31. <laughs> I 
So I asked what the best one to get, and he said chicken pot pie. So he got that covered, and I said, what else? He goes, well, the pork chop's huge and good. The beef brisket's the most popular. Uh, the chicken Florentine's good. <sighs> I don't know what to do. And then as far as drinks, I just, I honestly am at a loss. I'm just going to take a minute to try to figure it out. I'm thinking this lakeside breeze is what I'll get there. I'm craving pasta, though. I'm going to do pasta lakeside, I think, and then the lakeside breeze. And then we know you're doing the chicken pot pie. Are you going to do a drink? Yeah, lakeside Which, Collins. Lakeside Collins. A lot of lakeside in here. Okay, this is very interesting. So this room is Tremaine's Tavern. The... What's the... So the menu is the same for all of the dining. Yes. In there is the Beauclair dining room. Yes, we'll try to go in there and take a peek of the Beauclair dining room. This is Tremaine's Tavern. This is Tremaine's Tavern, and it does have the live music. Yep, and then outside is the veranda. Yeah, but all three have the same menu. It's just a preference of where you want to sit. So I'm thankful we're in here. This is pretty cool. Glad we ask and learn more about that. And that makes sense why, why there's no menu for Tremaine's Tavern. It's just the one menu because they serve the same menu for all of it. So currently there's no one in the restroom. I just kind of wanted to show you. They still kept it pretty old school in here. I like it a lot. And here's what that other dining room area looks like. So a little bit more quiet, a little bit more of like a fancy style. Then you have the front porch area which is it's very hot outside so not many are out there right now and then you have the little tavern area that we're in and there's the stairs i showed you earlier so they're all kind of just connected all the same menu so it looks like we'll eat at just this restaurant because there's only one of them and that makes sense all makes sense now that sign out front said tremaine's tavern doesn't open until 11 but they serve breakfast but they serve breakfast probably either at the, yeah, in the actual dining area or the veranda. It's all making sense now. We do all the hard stuff so that when you come, you don't have to do all the hard stuff. All right, here is a look at my drink. That is a very large drink. I'm a little scared to see how much it's going to cost. And there's a look at your drink. Again, no prices, so we'll have to just see at the very end. Let's give it a try. Oh, that's very like, Refreshing. Refreshing. Yeah. Uh, did it say cucumber? Mm -hmm. There's cucumber right there. You can definitely taste the fresh cucumber and in there. Peach schnapps. Yeah, peach schnapps. How's yours? Good. What's it like? Mm -hmm. Kind of like maybe Arnold Palmer ish. Really? Kind of. Let's try it. Let's swap. You're a big cucumber fan, so you're going to like that a lot. I don't know. It's way stronger than yours. Do you like it? Oh. I like the cucumber, but yeah. it's, I think it's a, like a liquor that I don't like. Oh, let me try yours. It is pretty dark in here, so sorry if it's a little blurry. I mean, it's very dark, actually. Yeah, yours is more of like the... Yeah, like a... Kind of a mint julep-ish taste to it. Love all the detail in here. It's kind of nice that we're the only ones currently in here, so I can, like, film the whole place. But what? it's close to 6, and I guess live music tonight, right? Live piano music? In 20 minutes. The food might be pricey, but it smells and looks delicious. Here is the pasta. Look at the steam coming off that. And then wait till you see this pot pie. Look at this pot pie. That looks like the best pot pie I've ever seen. <laughs> hey, that matches. Your shirt matches in here. Good work. This smells. Smell this. Smell this. It smells so good. Looks like we'll be sharing. I have no idea if they have dessert or not. What's that look like on the inside? Can we get a plate turn here? Oh, it's heavy. <laughs> Holy smokes. That... That's gonna be a top notch, probably. There's really no easy way to film this because the plate's massive, but let's try the uh, pasta. Look at that steam. Here we go. Yeah, that's tasty. That's good. Oh, hold on. Her eyes are the size of the moon. <laughs> good? The best chicken pot pie you've ever had in your life? 
Holy cow. And you could easily share that. I mean, I know it's 10 extra dollars, but $10 is cheaper than two entrees. I'm gonna have to give it a try. Look at that. Wow. Look how hot my plate is. <laughs> Here's the chicken pot pie. That's the best I've ever had. Yep. That's gonna go down as the best chicken pot pie ever. I would 100% come back and get that. It's delicious. So mine is very good. However, this might be a top 10 food item of all time. It is amazing. So they've started the live music now. This is, this is really cool. We're gonna ask about dessert. We did as best as we could. We kind of switched plates there for a little bit. Stuffed, but I have to give this place a thumbs up. This place gets a stinking good. So they do have dessert and they gave us the dessert menu. What is, I'm gonna look at this side while you look at that side. Oh, some drinks. Maybe dessert drinks it looks like. And then here's what they have, orange creamsicle. Here's what they have for the mile high carrot cake. Peanut butter, oh my goodness. Peach clover, I don't know. This is what you would expect out of a place like this. You're thinking carrot cake probably. <laughs> We're stuffed, but we have to get some. Oh, lemonberry does look good. Live music's going on here, I mean. Also our waiter's over there by the piano guy and he is a fantastic waiter, amazing. This place is a top notch place. And the good news is you don't have to have a reservation like at the hotel to come in here. They, it's not really that crowded right now. It's a, what is today, a Wednesday, but you can get reservations if you want. But I, I would recommend this place in downtown Mount Dora. So we said all desserts are very good. Um, we went with a lemon berry, so we're gonna give that a try. Love the music in the background. What'd you just read about this place? President Calvin Coolidge, um, first lady, stayed here after his retirement for like a month. That is cool. And then while we're talking, holy cow, there's the, what is it again? Lemonberry mascarpone. Lemonberry mascarpone. It is lemonberry mascarpone. He's very good on the piano. All right, oh, here we go. And as you would expect, that is delicious. So, <laughs> how is it that you just literally had that size of piece in your mouth? How is it? Stinking good. I'd say if I had to pick my least favorite thing, probably my drink. But everything else was delicious and I've even got all my drink down. So I mean like, if that's the worst thing, then you know this place is stinking good. I mean, it's so good. Now, I'm guessing it's gonna be a pretty expensive meal. I think the dessert itself was $10. I'm sure drinks are at least 10. So there's 30, not including the two over $20 meals. So you're talking, it's probably gonna be in the 80s. However, it is a top, top place, as it should be. It is a very good, stinking good restaurant. And I would recommend if you have any sort of special occasion, come on out here, get the chicken pot pie. Or, that's true. Or if you're staying here, or now that you know there's a restaurant inside here, if you're looking for a place in Mount Dora to eat, come here. And honestly, there's no dress code, which is nice. I mean, the dining room's a little bit more fancy-ish, but the tavern, you have people wearing everything from shorts to jeans to whatever. So don't feel like you're underdressed because there is no dress code. All right, let's take a look at the bill. And I was pretty much accurate there. So drinks, 12 and $14, dessert, nine, and then you got a 20 and 27 for a total of $87.74. You can do, oh, you can do a room charge, like I said before. So, or you can just pay. All right, we are all finished, so we are heading 
back outside. Amazing piano player. Now we're in the lobby, gonna head out this way. Okay, and so this is the veranda, but it's still the same menu, same restaurant. So we forgot to do an outro of Tremaine's Tavern. Yep. I think we were a little too excited to see what the res the hotel, I almost said resort, I guess it's kind of like a resort, the hotel had to offer that we just went with our day. So we wanted to do a little bit of a recap and say that Tremaine's Tavern was great. Yeah. Like I said earlier in the video, you have the veranda, the Tremaine. Oh. Tremaine's Tavern. Mm -hmm. And the Beauclair Dining Room. And all three have the exact same menu. There's not four separate restaurants. There's basically one restaurant with, f f well, there's three. three. There's the um, bar at the pool. So that's one, that's not technically a restaurant though. Then you have the other three, but the other three share the same menu. It's just a matter of where you wanna sit. Now I do think the veranda and the dining room are the two places that serve breakfast. I know for sure the the veranda serves yeah. breakfast, but the Tremaine's Tavern doesn't open until later in the day. Yeah. So hopefully that cleared it up for you. We were very confused at first, but really enjoyed it. And that was, we both said, the best chicken pot pie we have ever had. And I said it goes down as maybe a top 10 item of all time. Yeah, we'll be going back for that for sure. Next time we'll just go and share it because the portion sizes were large. Yeah. And they did have a lot of good choices for dessert. Um, my drink I would probably not get next time. My drink was But your good. drink was good. So. The dessert was very good as mm -hmm. well. And they had very good choices and the staff very friendly. Mm -hmm. So if you're looking at maybe eating somewhere in downtown Mount Dora, Feel free to head on in to Lakeside Inn and you can choose one of those three locations on where you want to sit and then just know it's the same menu. They have that menu online and it's great. Would highly recommend it. Yep. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.